Hey guys, Jacob the Kingston Ravens. Today we're looking at top five Reaper skins. Now I'm a Reaper main. I like Reaper. So I like a lot of his skins. I don't have any good ones for him though, sadly. I only really got this. I don't like Blackwatch at all. I think it looks bad. But I'm very close. I'm at 850 credits. I'm so close to getting a new Reaper skin. Alright. So number five we got Dracula. And I got little cue cards, so like I know what to say in this. I think it's a solid skin. The skin itself, I mean, is solid. The face is kind of what puts me off. The rest of it looks awesome, but the face... It's a little bit too simple. But it's not bad. The guns look very good. Common thing you're going to see in this video is that Reaper's guns look awesome. <laughs> Some of the best guns in the game, so obviously I'm going to like those. It fits his character, you know, he's the Reaper and Dracula, you know, he's a vampire. Kind of, sort of similar. And he's also called the Reaper. Like, this is the skin in the Drunken Sign game mode. So, and of course, it's going to be generally pretty creepy. And I quite like it. So, number four, we got his soldier skin. Now, again, it's young Reaper, like Blackwatch Reyes, but even younger then. With some nice hair. He's not bald. What do you know? Reaper had hair at one point. Oh my god. It's a miracle. <laughs> Again, the guns look pretty good. These ones are more simple, but obviously they're modeled after more realistic guns. They look good. The attention to detail, the little things on his arms and the actual armor. And then the camo. Throughout his body and his little microphone to talk to his team. The colors look like something you would see in a military official with the brown and the camo. And obviously it fits in with the lore of being young Reaper. Again, very good skin. Number three, we have Pumpkin. This is based off of the Legend of Sleepy Hollow and the Headless Horseman who had, instead of a head, he had a jack-o'-lantern or a pumpkin. So, that's awesome. Again, very good guns with the candles and the pumpkins and it looks nice and the candles are actually flaming. But this is going to my next point. It's scary. It actually looks terrifying. It looks awesome and it has so many layers to it, you know what I mean? And then the flames obviously are awesome. I already said that. And again, it was the original Drunken Stein Reaper skin that said Dracula. And I like it because of that. Number two. Oh boy, we got Nevermore. It's awesome. <laughs> So it's based off of the book by Edgar Allan Poe, The Raven. And if you didn't know, that's why it's called Nevermore, because a big quote from that is like, I think it's Nevermore, children, Nevermore, like, move along or something. And one thing I like is that I am from New England, so in Boston there's a statue of Edgar Allan Poe running out of the city because he hated it so much. So it kind of connects back to my area, and it looks good. Again, very creepy, mostly because that hood covering up the face of the actual raven. And the eyes and the guns are, like, barely visible. The feathers look good, and he's got raven skulls on his shoulders. A lot of attention to detail here. It just looks like a creepier version of his default skin, with a bit of purple. And finally, number one. Is biker. So first off, the face and the helmet. It looks like a skull, but it like actually fits inside the helmet, which in itself look aw looks awesome. The colors are good. I love the fact that it has Edge written on his left leg. I think that that's absolutely hilarious. And it's edgy, you know. And it's based off of MXB motocross biking. If you didn't know, that's professional bikers. Again. The best Reaper guns, by far. I love it. <laughs> My favorite Reaper skin. So, thank you guys for watching. Like and subscribe, and I'll see you all next time. Bye.